Hey, it's KMA. How's your day today? And welcome to the corner. So another week of my schedule has gone through and everything seems to be okay. It seems to be I'm tolerating my schedule. Um, I'm getting the things done that I'm supposed to be getting done and everything is going well. So it seems like uh, being able to release videos seven days a week is a thing that I can continue and I'm keeping free the time that I plan on streaming uh, you know I, before i started recording I, said, I should turn off my my phone uh let me at least lower 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 okay oh fudge okay sorry <laughs> text message anyways so guys um so in order for to get good content or uh consistent good content out to you I have uh, set up standards before I would put out videos that I was like eh, I don't know and I just put it out now when I'm kind of like yeah I don't know I don't put it out I fix it I make sure it's okay um, I'm making sure I'm not putting out anything that isn't up to standards I want to before I would put out things just to keep a schedule if that makes any sense okay I'm just gonna do something real quick and Throw it in the video so that the video can be out and be of certain length and be out on schedule. I'm even though I do have a strict schedule, I am making sure I don't do that. I have uh, recorded three or four different parts of videos over again this week, and I still have everything done. So basically, my day is I wake up at six or six thirty, depending um, on how well I slept the night before, and I wake up have breakfast. Which is basically a couple pieces of toast. <laughs> yeah, great breakfast. Uh, and then I record. Each each morning I have a different recording that I have planned out. And on Saturday, which is today, I plan out my week. So I know exactly how my episodes are going to go. What I'm going to record every single day of the week for that particular episode. And so forth and so forth. So I have everything planned out. So when I hit the record, I'm ready to go. And that night, I know what to do in the Minecraft world so that I need to complete. So the next morning when I record uh, the building or whatever I'm looking to build for the video or whatever I'm doing in the video is recorded the next morning. And it seems pretty good. I um, do basically two recordings every morning. Um, and when I do recordings... Like a Mr. Craft average recording is five or six minutes long. Uh, sometimes dark times are like 10 minute long. Uh, KMA play, the recordings are seven minutes long. That's how, <laughs> that's how much I've got this uh, cut down. I am a man of, hmm, in order for me to create, I have to, hmm, how can I put this? I, re I create better under circumstances. Uh, certain circumstances because I have so much when I'm flowing which happens to be right now and creatively flowing I have so much going on that I actually have to put a filter or a blockage to block most of it out so I can get some of it out that makes any sense like um little rules I've had in the past little rules that I did with music okay uh, I can only write this song in Mixolydian or I don't, uh, you know, the different modes, okay, I'm, okay, this whole song is going to be based on the diminished chord, you know, I give myself something to limit the ideas that are to come around in my head, so I can actually pull something out of my head and create it, because there's so much going on, it's um, overwhelming, it's like a river, and I'm fishing, and just pulling out fish, and the fishing line is the limitations <laughs> that I can pull out, I don't know how to really explain it. But uh, I'm flowing right now, so I'm going to get as much content out as I possibly can. So basically, when I wake up in the morning at 6, 6.30, I record two sessions of recordings for two different types of videos every morning. And that's six days a week, Monday through Saturday. Then I go to my first job, and when I'm done with my first job, I come home, I shower, I eat. Um, whatever, something, you know, just nibble, I don't have a meal. And then I go out and Uber, and then I Uber usually till 6, if I'm in the middle of a long ride, maybe till 7. And then I come home and I start working on 
completing the tasks that need to be done for recording the next morning. And once I'm done with that, I edit what I recorded that morning. And if there's any um, more that needs to be done, like animation or or uh, images, I, I'll create that, then I'll go to sleep. And that's basically six days a week. Then Sunday I, is my main recording day for the non-Minecraft stuff. Everything that's non-Minecraft, other than this recording on Saturday morning for the daily, weekly, whatever update, is uh, done on Sunday. So that's my schedule. Um, and just for your knowledge, my schedule has been... Uh, Video schedule has been Monday, Mr. Craft, Tuesday, Hearthstone, Wednesday, KMA Players, Thursday, F1, Friday, Dark Times, Saturday, this weekly update, and Sunday is going to be something new, which I need to tell you about. Um, of course, once I started this new schedule of, oh my god, I don't really have that much free time. But I'm going to enjoy myself anyways, and if things get a little hectic and I need to take the free time, I'll take a day off. I don't care, because uh, a schedule is one thing, and but my life is another thing. But my brother has hooked me up with another guy to do meditational breathing music. Um, so I'm going to, I am commissioned to make something. So tonight I'm going to make something, <laughs> and I'm going to record it. So Sunday's video will probably be a longer video of me creating music for myself or my brother or whatever. I will say this one's going to be a little bit weird because uh, he wants a meditational breathing thing. So it's not going to be electronic beats and all that other stuff. So I think maybe having the F1 series and the Hearthstone series and the music um, breaks things up. But honestly, the Hearthstone series is most likely going to go away. And I'm thinking of doing a music review series and moving the music creative series to Tuesday for Hearthstone and music taking the music review series and putting it on Sunday. But I'm trying to figure out a good way of doing the music review series properly without um, running into copyright issues. Because how can I, like, okay, I'm just going to pull an album. Uh, Nicki Minaj Queen. It's just... Just came out, whatever. It's not the type of music I'd be reviewing anyways. If I wanted to review the album, I'll go for a song that goes like this or whatever. And I, I could describe the song to you, but that kind of really doesn't give you an idea of what the song is all about. you got to really want to hear the song. So I'm going to try and figure out a way that I can do this. Um, I don't care about monetization. I don't do this for money at all. Um, so I was thinking of just having the music play and not even trying to monetize the video, but I also heard, and if somebody can confirm this with me, if I have videos monetized but not, but um, I have a, a series of videos that get striked because of, you know, that couldn't be monetized because of copyright material, I think that goes against my YouTube channel because if... One out of seven videos I make has copyright issues. That is, what, 14% about? Yeah, for about 14% of my videos, or 15% of my creativity, is non-monetizable in YouTube's eyes, which would make my channel non-monetizable, maybe? I don't know. So I gotta look into that, I don't wanna scare that, because ultimately, my goal with all this extra work that I'm putting in lately, and I will really show true when September comes and I start streaming again is that I want to get rid of the second Ubering job so I can I can start working on my content between three and six. So it'll give me an extra three hours a day. I Uber three hours a day, seven days a week. So 20 hours, it give me an extra 20, 21 hours a week where I can make content or more importantly, take that time off so I can hang out with my my daughter and my and Stacy <laughs> if I wanted to uh, I'm talking about Stacy I, ha I can hang out with my daughter but anyways one last thing before I go because this is getting ultra long already sorry um I'm starting a podcast I'm gonna put out the outline tonight I'm gonna do uh an episode zero kind of just put a podcast out telling you guys what the podcast is and I have asked my Patrons for introductions, and I've asked a couple, actually one person, 
um, in specific uh, to make an introduction for me. But if you on your own want to make an introduction to my podcast, it's audio only, go right ahead because I'll be switching in and out people's introductions because um, honestly, with a podcast, it's kind of stupid to introduce yourself. It's kind of like a going on a TV show, uh, go like, uh, I don't know, David Letterman or Johnny Carson. I'll just pick something that's not even on air right now. It's not David Letterman going, hey, I'm David Letterman. I'm going to come out from the curtain now. It's, you know, he has somebody introduce you. And the podcast is sort of set up the same kind of way. It just is a lot more professional if you have somebody else introduce you. So if you want to uh, take a 15, 20 second recording of yourself um, introducing me, go right ahead. Uh, send me a DM and ask me the best way to send it to me. And I probably use it. I may edit it a little bit uh, if the timing you know, to my specifications, I should say. Um, so don't worry about it if it's kind of raw and unnatural. Not unnatural, but if it's kind of raw and it doesn't seem professional, I will um, I will do my best to make it work for what I'm looking for. So guys, that's what's going on. Um, I wish I had more free time to hang out with people. That's the, that's the worst thing about all this is that I want to hang out with you guys and be with you guys, hang out on streams, but uh, my my schedule, even if I wasn't doing YouTube right now, it's so crazy that I can't do it. So I apologize for not being around, not being able to hang out with you guys, but I appreciate you guys still sticking with me a little bit and um, keeping things real with all the stuff that's been going on. And now that I'm on like a creative role and my, my creativity is like, diarrhea coming out of my head um i'm gonna get as much of this out before it goes away because uh it's been a while since i've had this much flow of creativity and i just um i've been in a drought for years and years and years and all of a sudden have all this creativity come back and it's like holy crap i gotta get it all out before it stops again and just Make sure uh, that it's all all comes out before I go. Okay, so what do I do here? I have no idea. So what should I do with this video series? I have no idea. That's how the last like three, four, five years have been. How do I write this song? What type of song should it be? I have no idea. Well, let's start. Hmm. Gee. I have no idea. But now I have the ideas, so I'm gonna make sure I. Uh, take the time and get these ideas out. So, if anything, I'm going to be abusing you guys with too much content, but you can always go back and look at it at a different time. The so podcast uh, coming out this week at some point. I'm going to choose a day, got to choose a time, got to do a little research to find out when the best time to release podcasts are and uh, go from there. But thank you guys. Everything's working so much better for me right now. And uh, I hope to see you soon. And, um, just think, September, I will be back streaming again, so at least there's going to be a couple hours, a few times a week, where you get, or I can hang out with people um, that actually really motivate me, it's because it's you guys that really kind of motivate me, and um, the ability that I see that people like to see my ideas, even though I may go a little too extreme sometimes, uh, for the most part. It seems like my ideas are pretty well received, and um, I don't know. That motivates me, so uh, I appreciate it. Without you guys, there wouldn't be me really doing this, because this is a lot of effort. Yeah, you might say a YouTuber sitting home all day long and playing videos. I, I work almost 90 hours a week. I'm, I'm basically... Well, if you take real work, I'm I'm working every day from eight o'clock in the morning till uh, six o'clock at night. So with ten hours a day, that is sixty hours for the six days. Then then I work on Sunday, which is a little more. Then if you add in the work I do for YouTube and getting uh, the content creation done, it goes well over ninety hours. 
which right now is fine for me. Yeah, that's why I turn off my notification. My phone is buzzing over there. It's probably because of something. Anyways, thank you guys. Long, I kind of rambled at the end, but I appreciate you if you are still here because you are awesome. And let me know in the comments if you made it to the very end. Because uh, that's rather cool. Thank you guys. Have a great weekend.